All right, let's venture to this one. I'm really curious about the gun store. So I'm assuming this is a hardware store, then a gun store, and then we'll head back to base, which is all the way over here. This is where we got our car the first time. I, I built a little little grinder there, so I call it Bravo List. The grinder there is just to keep the city clear of corpses. Okay, I can't see anything with the... Uh, Okay, I'm gonna pick that up though. I can't see anything with the dashboard in my way. Cars drop a lot of uh, mechanical components, and you can build them one at a time with an iron plate. I'd rather just pick them up from cars. Why did the stock fall out of my car? Is it, did it? Hold on, I, I, I am very curious about this. Did it fall off my gun or something? I don't think so, because my gun isn't using a stock. I don't know. I don't even know. Maybe it was just randomly on the floor, but I doubt it. And it's almost a road. Oh, what is this? What is this? <laughs> I didn't hit. Oh, I was gonna say I surprised I didn't hit either of those, and I just end up smashing a regular rock. Yeah, the hitbox for rocks is really large, larger than it appears. Almost there. That is not a hardware store. <laughs> it is a uh, shipping container warehouse. I'm trying to, is this something I can drive on? It's Okay, I wasn't sure if that was a bridge or... Yeah, it's... still there's not enough room on it. Music's being weird. I mean, there's generally only one track, and that's the one that gets me copyright ID'd, but. <laughs> Dude! He had. He bit me from mega far away. Did you see that?
Yeah, it lags that much when I open inventory, even with when I have a completely blank backpack. Environmentally friendly garbage grinder. door I mean unless it spawns them I'm not really worried about tracking the zombies but it may spawn them I'm just hoping there's no zombies inside. That would be kind of obnoxious. lag so much that it, it didn't even register me clicking on collect. Wouldn't even know this was an exit. I mean, this is only because probably a zombie bit through the wall. Iron, wow. Okay. I will say that sound effect for breaking the door, it's like very realistic because every time I hear it, I feel like I'm hearing those sounds in my house. Now I am wearing headphones, but normally I did not even like no normally I don't think anything of it. The supermarket's pretty bereft of goods. It's normally what you see in a, a video game. It's just a shelf with maybe one can of food on it, if anything at all. Not cool. That's why I wasn't actually investigating these. <laughs> There's a third one in there too. I guess he just didn't notice me when I was running out the door after getting hit. I don't normally have anything to do with blasters after I kill them, I just walk the other way. figure if that zone's already damaged, I might as well just put the rest of them on there. Yeah, your character's kind of locked into this. I can't even turn off my flashlight.
Man, just not hitting anything. Seriously, I right, just back away from the wall. I think the dude went inside the container. I think he just phased through it. So, normal game plan. I'll finish clearing the area, and then I'll grab all the loot that I can fit into my truck. And I have enough room for the gun shop on the way out, but we'll see. That's a botany monster. Couldn't go for the headshot because he's by the wall. He waited there for me. Weird that the shipping container area has its own music. I saw you. Well, let's approach that one last. Yeah, I didn't think there'd be anything in it. He probably was wounded for me hitting him with the car or something. I've never killed a dude with a grappling hook. I mean, it says did dirty damage, but I didn't even know that I didn't even know they took damage. Remember, but when I'm in combat, I'm not actually looking at the little messages at the side of the screen. And it was a shotgun with a suppressor or something on it and a scope. Actually, I'm gonna kind of look at that. Yeah, it's got a reduction stock here and big handmade suppressor on the front, as well as a red dot. I mean, sure. That looks special. 
Let me deal with the big guy first, and then we'll open up the red one. Oh, well, okay, I still got a few more to go. Go ahead and dump off my, my stuff first while I'm over here. All right, I've dumped off my stuff. Let's open these last few containers, then we'll deal with the big guy. Actually, that chest next to my truck is just full of iron daggers. I actually do need to grab that. Not this time. Only once. And I figured I was just paranoid anyways. So I stopped doing it. And I still have my air pistol as well, so... Is there even anything in there? No. I get back to base, I'm gonna have so many mutagenic doses. Start by drinking this the to top off. Throwing a Molotov. Actually, real fast. I don't think I can fire through. I want to melee this guy. Yeah, I'm just hitting the container. Oh, jeez. Oh, good thing I topped off. That took off about a third of my life. I mean, it's not quite the epic battle. I could try to flank him and hit him in the head, but I want to get closer. Even just a regular spitter zombie takes me off one third of my life.
Apparently this... Whoa! I thought you died, dude. Apparently you just stunned. I don't even let you have the decency to finish falling. I'm just gonna dissect you now. I have the cards glitching out of my inventory. Just a bunch of small canteens. I'll sweep it up nonetheless, just because I want to make sure I pick up all my shotgun shells, which I already have, apparently. Alright, my dude's bleeding. Try to keep myself fully healthy because zombies do tons of damage to me if they ever get close enough. Tran use shipping container. I'm sure the data is important, but I want to see what these guns are. RPK machine gun, a general purpose light machine gun designed by Kashnikov. Uses 7.62 rifle bullets with love from Mother Soviet. I mean, I figured there was nothing there, but I just have to make sure for the for this place. Investigative report. A suspected rabies patient is subdued after scratching and biting several people. The patient completely lost the ability to speak and kept screaming. Symptoms consistent with advanced rabies. Its body appears to have mutated with protrusions and secretions overflowing. The patient is very aggressive. The use of anesthesia has no effect on him. For the convenience of transportation, the only choice is to destroy his brain tissue. The patient tried to attack after being shot twice in the head and missing half of his brain. Fired several more shots to dispose of it. This appears to be a new strain of rabies. Not sure if it's contagious. The sample has been handed over to the laboratory team for processing. I will continue to investigate. I th what I think is ridiculous is in all the zombie video games and media, nobody ever has any idea what a zombie is. <laughs> okay, we got the RPK. Um, we didn't get the vector or anything, but maybe that's the other shipping place? Or maybe it was taken from the other shelf? I don't know. Okay, nothing else to grab behind it or anything. Alright, I need to go through and loot everything. I'll probably just dispose of the canteens. I actually have a use for the small bottles, small plastic bottles, because you make glue with them and you don't get the bottles back after, after you're done. But these things, I have no idea what to do with them. I mean, I have plenty of containers. I don't need these empty ones, so I'll probably just chuck them. I'm going to go and save for now and loot this when I come back. Uh, hopefully everything's still there. <laughs> and call it a day, because I'm going to try to record some barrel trauma before my, before my family gets home. So thank you very much for watching Train Plays Zed Zone. I'll see you next time, where we hit the gun store.